Middlebury first. Um, I mean, obviously, you guys played them once already this year. Do you take anything from that game into this matchup? Well, Middlebury's always been a like uh, a tough game for us. Uh, they play a different system. Uh, we've built a pretty good rivalry over the years uh, with them. Um, we love playing them. They love playing us. So the emotional level is high. So I don't know if you can, you could probably just throw out all the X's and O's and the team that wants it the most, the team that makes the least amount of mistakes and the team that sacrifices the most is probably going to win the game. And I mean, they have the, the bigger ice service, obviously you guys have played on big ice a few times this season already. Will that be much of an adjustment? There is a big adjustment going from a small arena to a big arena, opposed to a big arena to uh, a smaller one. Yeah. So we're going to go uh, over there and practice on Friday morning. That's something we usually don't do. So we're going to go over there and practice Friday morning and uh, then check on our hotel and get at least a little skate in uh, on the big ice sheet because it, it is a big difference. Uh, the prime scoring area doesn't change no matter how big of the rink, but uh, uh, you know, looking out of the corner of your eye for the boards and you can't see them, it's, it's definitely an adjustment. And Middlebury has a, a strong PK, and I mean, up until Saturday, that's the power play is obviously something you guys have been struggling a little bit with. Just, I mean, what do you think's been going on there? Well, I think I think uh, power plays. Is, is, there's a lot to attribute to a successful power play, and then the number one uh, thing that attributes to a successful power play is a weak penalty killing unit that you're playing against. Our schedule's been real tough as of late, and. Uh, um, you know, I, I look at a power play, watch it over and over on, on video, and, and, and uh, you know, on a bounce here or there, we're going to get some open net rebounds. And, uh, you know, most power play goals are rebounds now, and we're not getting a ton of rebounds on the power play. So I'm hoping that uh, uh, we, if we keep getting pucks in the net and keep working hard, the rebounds will come. And, I mean, you've obviously been winning without scoring too many power play goals. So does that mean, I mean, you're not too worried about it? Or is it still something as a coach that you're always concerned about? Well, I am definitely that coach that believes that nothing beats winning. And there's no doubt about it. And as long as you find a way to win, you know, we didn't play good in the third period against Castleton, but I was proud of the guys that we found a way to win, you know. But uh, uh, we're going to continue to work on all aspects of the game. And uh, we work on our power play every week. And uh, we watch a lot of the power play on video, the players do. And, uh, and hopefully if we can keep working hard, I'm a big believer that hard work pays off sometimes, somewhere, somewhere.